Yeah, that would make sense. And it's going to be Aegis. Okay. Combined. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, and Nido Sharp obviously did very well against Beast. Uh, and we're going to be seeing the same same lineup that we expect, right? It's going to be, well, okay, maybe not the same lineup. We do add Diddy Kong into the mix. Yeah, instead of K Roll. Yeah, no K Roll. No, no uh, messing around with K Roll this time. Yeah, technically, technically, this is this is the expected, but yeah. It, I would not want to put K Roll into this lineup. No, I wouldn't either. I certainly wouldn't. Right now, I think he gets boxed out by everyone on the list. And Ned, menacingly starting with the Sephiroth, the new hotness. Yep. Again, the classic of just front-loading your main, seeing how far they can uh, steamroll uh, potential secondaries until uh, they get taken out. Yeah, that's very true. And they're forcing this spot dodge early. Hopefully that means that Nido Sharp can start getting in Ned's head. This is where uh, you got to out... Okay, I'm going to pretend I didn't see that. That pivot grab, That we're going to pretend like <laughs> we didn't see that, right? Yeah. Okay, anyway, so... Out of sight, out of mind. Yeah, exactly. So you're able to get some, some nice uh, spacing, and if you're using your movement, as I know that Ned can do, uh, this character can actually, like, outpatient you, and in many ways. I actually think Sephiroth is particularly dirty in this format. Because oh. if you get the first stock, your next character has to start against them with wings. True. Oh, my God, you're right. That is really unfortunate, actually. Yeah. And hopefully he's, you know, he, he might not even get wing this early because Wolf, unfortunately for Nido Sharp, is not doing the work that he needs it to do. Going for the Trump, I like it. The Trump back air is absolutely crucial for Sephiroth in these key moments, and we're already starting that conditioning off right. Yeah. Yeah, I was surprised that uh, Sharp dropped to that uh, ledge trap. They were doing so well on the last set. Yeah, absolutely. Just disengaging, going for the laser as well, looking for one of these back airs. That's the Wolf Classic. In theory, Ned uh, is kind of running scared, as he should be, but, I mean, these close-range uh, opportunities, I'm waiting for him to pick one up. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um, okay. Uh, maybe Nido Sharp will hand it to them instead. He was just that scary. He was just that scary. Hey, he has wing now. Oh, man, I got to get out of here. Yeah, and he's got banana in hand and wing, and he's yeah, he's fast now because he has wing, right? His airspeed gets better. He, oh, yeah. he gets better air drift. Now he is actually, like, he feels like a, a much more mobile character than he normally is. Yeah, and, and Ned Sephiroth is already plenty mobile. Yeah. Good stuff. Uh, Going to have to charge up. Yep. Oh, okay. He goes straight for the blade dash. He had his jump, so it's all good. <laughs> and... Now that uh, they have playing so much of the rules of engagement are now dictated by them. Exactly. Diddy, and that's what, usually what Diddy Kong wants to do with their banana. Yeah, honestly. And we're going to get that. Oh, the scintilla just not enough. Really good angle there from Nido Sharp. So smart. Looking for something else. I'm surprised he's going for forward air and not like up air, but I don't know. I was going to say Mr. Banana confirmed. I oh, picked it up. It was a tech read the whole time. Very true, very true. Going for the B-reverse on the flare. Can he get back? The guns are not going to stop him this time. No wing, though. That, that is relevant. Yeah. But, like, every okay. hit here is gravy. Ooh, excuse me. That's a lot of damage. But that means free our sin, pretty much. So now uh, that you're off the tether grab, this actually might be better for Sephiroth, to be honest with you. Oh, never mind. Nido Sharp still has those drag downs. This is a full character of our send you got to burn through. Yeah, exactly. But, I mean, that, unfortunately, does tick down uh, rather quickly these days. So Aegis now going to be trying to do some of the work here. Mithra, okay, you do get caught here. Now the extension. Ah, oh, very nice. Ex yep, we got it all. Nido Sharp is getting a string and a half right now. No jump. Not able to make it back to ledge. No good confirmed there. Falls out of the multi hits. Yeah, they're both trying to nail their way to victory. Okay, squeaks underneath the up smash. A moment of clarity there for Nido Sharp. A bit of a scrambly situation. Oh, Ooh. hold on a minute. Okay, okay. Never mind. Nope, never mind. Yay. Except for that part where you got cut in half. But. Exactly, <laughs> right? Other than that, you're totally fine. You just only you only got bisected. It's okay. Um, so we're going to get sent out by Pyra F-Tilt, but uh, the Joker was looking good. This plan by what? Ned is just working out. And so far, yeah. Just Again, front load on the Sephiroth. Yep. Uh, just, again, Ned Sephiroth, just, you know, one of the best in the business. Yeah. yeah. Well, you can't, can't say enough like, good things about it. It's exactly. just extremely clean. Right? Between him and Ken, like, those two Sephiroths alone are carrying the day for this character. And now we've got, starting off with the Diddy Kong Nido Sharp against this Sephiroth. Hopefully going to be able to, uh, to stuff out that momentum and keep Sephiroth from being a threat at least until he can get Wing out of the way, right? And then maybe maybe we'll just take that out of the equation. 
Yeah, this is actually a really good idea. I think Diddy Kong in general has like a good plan versus Sephiroth. Yeah. Which is that last time uh, they got to start with the wing. Yep. And that's the last thing you want to see. Exactly. So you're be able to get one of those nice frame seven nares very, very quick. But and it does link into itself as well as other things. Forward air can be a nice little combo ender for that one. Oh, yeah. Yep, can't go anywhere. The roll out, you just have no oh, no life goodness. straight through the barrels. And while uh, not as sharp, they are known for their ZSS. It's quite good. Yes. Uh, I don't like ZSS in this matchup. Yeah, I'm a little bit nervous now because that I mean that means no reason. So jump didn't get the yeah didn't get the flip kick back obviously because they used it. Okay, and he just got wing. Yeah, just got wing now on the last stock, and it's Joker. So technically, you'll get a lot of Arsene uptime because you are in a huge deficit here. Yeah, and you need it. You definitely <laughs> Like need right it. now. Exactly. ASAP, but going to be able to do it with base Good Joker expert. alone. Very, very nice. Again, going one of those deep edge guards. Very, very clean stuff from Nido Sharp. Just needs to maintain that momentum. Oh, uh -oh. that was a good idea. Not quite able to get the punish. Though. Exactly, right? Like, that that is such a good spacing there from, from Nino Sharp. Even though his back was against the wall, he still had the ability uh, to get out uh, and get away from that foresight recovery. So. Now, starting to roll in a lot is Ned. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about it because Nino Sharp hasn't really been punishing too hard, but we are seeing signs of life here. And this is, this is where it gets very difficult. Yep. Yeah. Got no more Arsene. Given Pirate your percentage, up. it's unlikely you'll, you're going to get another one unless you get some Rebels Guard action. Interesting. Yeah, so we went for the we went for the Pyro and then immediately back into the Mithra. I'm not sure. That was probably, unfortunately, the wrong choice. Nido Sharp but. is going to be able to take that one. 100%. Can Ned's PT be able to close this one out with another 2-0? And now, uh, things aren't looking too bad. There's actually a good chance that we, uh, we get to the big guy back. Yeah, I agree. We might get a second Arsene. He's going to be absolutely crucial here. He's going to need it. Squirtle's going to be doing the combos. Wait a minute. Not much you can do here. OK. Good maneuverability. Yeah, Squirtle kind of got neutralized completely there. For sure. One more hit, and I think Ned wants to make that one hit the last hit. Exactly, right? Like, you get a back air at ledge, like, okay, you might not need it. But, I mean, we are starting to cook a little bit of rage, and that's going to help get that up smash kill. Drop that shield. is it. Yeah, I had to make sure Arsene is too, too scary to let just come out. Certainly, certainly. But Ned, hey. Ned just thought, if I got one more hit in me, I got to make it count. For sure, for sure. So good stuff. Ned going to close that one out with a 2-0 over Nido Sharp, but it was hard fought. Nido Sharp was getting so close, um, and they showed a proficiency with more than just three characters, right? They were switching them off very effectively. Um, I did agree with the with your point on ZSS being, unfortunately, just boxed out by Sephiroth, and that was proven true. Oh, yeah. So. And I, I didn't expect it to get taken out that fast, but I, I do favor Sephiroth in that matchup. Yeah. And against uh, Sephiroth, like Ned, uh, he, he gives you Even no breaks so. at all. Even more so, yes. Like, absolutely. All right, we're going to go to a quick break, so please don't go anywhere. There's still more Ultimate Squad Strike that is yet to come, so we will see you in just a little bit. Yep, tons of great matches.